Hey guys, Arbor here. Today I'm doing the Eureka Math Grade 3 Module 2 Lesson 4 Homework. So let's get started. Okay, so first it says record your homework start time on the clock in problem 6. Um, okay, wait, hold on. Um, so right now for me, I don't know about you guys, but it's like 9.14, so I'll do 9. 14, that'd be 5, 10, 15, so that'd be like here. So yeah, 9, uh, 14. Okay, right, so let's go back to that. Okay, so use the number line to answer problems 1 through 4. Alright, so number 1. Joy's mom begins walking at 4, 12 p.m. She stops at 4, 43 p.m. Uh, how many minutes does she walk? So let's make our number line. So four, she starts at four. Um, here we can do just five. So four. Um, do 10, 20, 30, 40. Oh, that is not very even. Um, we can just like kind of like redo them. <laughs> that was not as even as I thought it was gonna be. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50. That's a bit better. And I'm in between, you can draw a little text. Alright, so we have four. We can just label it to five. 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, and 55, 60. Alright, so Joy's mom begins walking at 4.12. So we can do like one. one. So 4.12 would be over here. So this is when she starts walking. And then she starts at 4.43. So let's first get this to 4.43. 413 so it ends at a 3 2 so that's plus 1 and then now we can just keep on jumping 5 so 5 10 15 20 25 30 that's 30 minutes and we land at 443 so 30 plus 1 is 31 crap it here which means um joy's mom walks for 31 minutes and then 12 plus 31 is also uh 43 so that makes sense for two cassie finishes softball bat practice at 352 uh after practicing for 30 minutes what time did um cassie's practice start all right so three o'clock right here and this will be four. All right, so let's draw a text. So three, three, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50. Let's draw the thing in between. All right, so let's label it. We can label it. So five, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. All right, so she finished at 3.52, but after, after practicing for 30 minutes, so what time did she start? So this time we're working backwards. So 52, 52, then she practiced for 30 minutes. So let's see, we can go back. So one, uh, two, like over here, and then three, I think I like wait four fifty two jump to hold up something went wrong here. So let's see, hold up four fifty two will be right here. So let's jump by ten. So let's jump to forty two would be like here. So ten, twenty, thirty. 
So that's plus 30. So then here we have 322. So here we have 352 and we went back 30. That gives us 322, which means Cassie's practice started at 322 p.m. Number three, Jordy builds a model from 914 to 947. Uh, how many minutes does Jordy spend building his model? Let's see. Um, do our line. So we have nine. Oh, why did I write that there? We have nine p.m. and then ten o'clock p.m. So let's see. We have nine, ten, twenty, thirty, forty, fifty, and then our ticks in between. So we have zero, five, ten, fifteen, twenty. So we just did our ticks. And let's see. So 914 and 947. So 14 would be over here. And let's try to get that to 47, to 917 first to um, make the 7 match. So, so that would be 1. 17 would be here. So we 1, 2, 3. So that's plus 3. So now let's go to 947. So we can go um, 1. Oh my god, we messed up the ticks again. Uh, and we jumped a bit too slow. So we're at 9, 17 right now. We're going to jump to 9, 27 right now. So that'd be 1, 2, and three that's plus 10 so now we're at 947 so um that's plus 30 actually we jumped 30 minutes plus 3 30 plus 3 equals 33 which means 14 plus 33 equals 47 so jordy builds for 33 minutes Item number four Kara finishes reading at 2.57. She reads for a total of 46 minutes. What time does she start reading? Okay, so it's another working backwards problem. So 2.57. Clock p.m. That'd be 3 o'clock p.m. So we have 10, 20, 30, 40. Let's put our ticks in between. Let's leave it at 0, 5, 10, 15, 20. Alright, so she finished at 257. So 57 would be over here. She reads for 46 minutes. So let's see. Let's start counting backwards. So 57. Um, that'd be. Let's jump 40, so that's 10, 20, 30, 40. So we jump from 57 um, to 17, that's 40 minutes. Now we minus 6 minutes, so then um, if we minus 5 minutes, that would be over here. So then 5, so now we only need... Uh, one more minute because we did 45. So we just do one more minute. Wait, wait, hold up. 57, 40 minutes. So we jump to 17 and then one minus five is 12. And I'll just do one more minute. So I'm to there. So then we went, um, we went back 46 minutes, so 2.57, um, then that lasted to 11, which would be right there. Because 40 plus 5 plus 1, that would be 46 minutes, so then 57 minus 46 is also 11. So yeah, so you start reading at 2.11 p.m. Alright, next page. Um, number 5, Jenna and her mom take the bus to the mall. 
The clocks below show when they leave their house and when they arrive at the mall. How many minutes does it take to, for them to get to the mall? Let's see. Well, they left the house at... Um, so the hour clock's at 3. And the minute hand's at 20, 21, 22, 23. So it looks like a 3.23. They arrive at the mall at, oh, at four, almost four, but I say it's three. So three, uh, 55, 56, 57, 58, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59. So 359. So if you take the minus 59 minus 23, that would give us 30. Um, six. So that means it takes them 36 minutes to get to the mall. All right, and now record our homework time. So we started at, uh, we started at like 9.14. So right now it's 9.25, which means, let's see, 9.25. So that's right here. It's 25 minutes, 14, that's 11 minutes. So it took us 11 minutes to do the whole lesson. So yeah. All right. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope this video helps. And please don't forget to like and subscribe because it really helps on my channel. See you guys next time. Bye.